The Bay Area is about to become the first place in the nation to implement tough new EPA requirements on cement plants. A new operating permit for the Lehigh cement plant in Cupertino will be the first in the country to require a significant reduction in mercury emissions. ABC 7's Karina Rusk has the latest chapter in this ongoing controversy. Starting in September of 2013, the EPA is requiring cement plants nationwide to significantly reduce mercury emissions. The Bay Area Air Quality Management District is about to release its proposed operating permit for Lehigh Cement Plant in Cupertino. It will be the first permit nationwide to incorporate standards that will reduce mercury emissions at the facility by 90 percent. The regulatory requirements are getting more stringent and so the conditions of the plant in terms of air emissions should certainly be improving as we move forward. Wallace Alviar lives a mile from the plant and welcomes the crackdown, but is worried two lawsuits already generated by the cement industry and a Republican-led Congress could block implementation. So we're very concerned that, you know, before these EPA restrictions go into effect, They'll be overturned, and then we'll be back to square one. Despite public concerns, Lehigh has long held the plant poses no health risk, but says it is ready to comply and will make the Cupertino plant a top priority. A Lehigh spokesperson in Texas talked to us by phone. We're moving forward with uh, looking at new control technologies and establishing new designs and, and getting those uh, uh, installed on time to meet the new rule. Even as Lehigh works to reduce its mercury emissions, the cement plant is also planning on expanding its mining operations. Lehigh wants the ability to create a new 200-acre quarry to replace the old one. Angry residents say they will fight that effort. The mercury precipitates, gets onto our vegetable gardens, we inhale it, it gets into our water tables, eventually it gets out into the bay. We've got to stop this. The new draft permit is expected in about two weeks. The public will have 60 days to comment. In Cupertino, Karina Rust, ABC 7 News.